crazy horse. He done took off. You left me out in the woods. Seven hours. Where did the horse go? Here, horse, horse, horse. Here, horse, horse. <laughs> horse just, he just, just galloped and left me. Oh, shit. What, what the hell is going on here? Let's play a little game, shall we? Did you know my ancestors wore the skins of their enemies as a coat? <gasps> oh shit, damn, I gotta move my cat? Hold on. Alright, let's just look a little bit. Try not to get caught. Are we not looking at anything specific? Hold on, go back, go back, go back, go back. I suppose I have full enough practice. But he didn't make it easy. What with all that bloody noise? <laughs> like a drowning cat. I thought he'd never oh, stop. Go back, go back, go back, go back. As my father likes to cut. say, a naked man holds few secrets. But <laughs> a naked man, man holds few secrets. A naked man like holds none. I <laughs> pity you didn't know your father was the warden of the you north. You came in this world naked, you gonna leave naked. He does now. How much further is it to these foresters? Uh, a day, my lord. Two at most. What was that? My lord? Shh! Listen! Oh, damn, you're coming over here. There. Oh my god, I'm about to die. Hear that? Uh, run, stay I still. I heard something. Stay still, stay still. Just, just, just be easy. Just be easy, stay still. Probably ain't even gonna come around. Never mind. Oh We've my god. Enough time already. Dude, if I would have took out running, they would have heard that. Uh, I was uh, I was quick on the triggers on that one, guys. I was very quick, quick with it. Cause I was I wanted to run, I ain't gonna lie. I said, nah, we gonna stay still. Now who was this guy they was carving up on over here? I don't even think I want to see the front of him. So I know he messed up. They left him to die. It's gonna scare the hell out of me if he's still alive. Don't holler. Don't you holler. Bloody hell. Wow. Lord Ethan, as I was saying, you are young, and there are those within these walls who are uncertain of your leadership. But 300 generations of Forester Lords stand behind you. Lord Gerhard the Tall, who founded our house, and your grandfather, Lord Thorin the Bold, who seized back the river valley from the White Hills. What do they call my father? Lord Gregor the Good. What would they he call me? and wise. I want to be like him. Courageous in battle. Are you telling me this? I want to be like that. Like my father. Your father was well regarded you got a ways by to go, everyone. young Ethan. It took years, if not decades, to earn. These were your father's people to lead and protect, and now they're yours. But your father did not bear this responsibility alone. He and every forester lord before him chose one man whom they trusted above all others. The Lord Sentinel. Forester traditions demand that a new Lord Sentinel must be chosen. Is he trying to get himself uh, chosen as, as a Lord Sentinel? That's what he, ooh, damn. Summon the Lord. We need his judgment. I've done nothing wrong! I was only trying to survive! What did he do? <laughs> Why did Lord you Ethan. kick him? Missed. Why did you kick this man? This Craven is a deserter and a thief. This house is doomed! We all fucking know it! <laughs> Why a thief? 
smack him right upside his head. He's supposed to be guarding our weapons, but instead we caught him stealing them. Why do you Two do it? Two shields and three spears. You stole from us. You stole from us. Tell the truth. I feared for my life. Yes, my lord. I fled. We should all flee. It's not stealing if you're taking what's yours by right. He speaks He's truth. Right. I have a family to feed. And not two coins to rub together since Lord Gregor left us to rot here. Where's our pay? Our share of bread and wine grows smaller every day. <laughs> Leave the poor man Damn. Lord Ethan, I know these words are hard, but they're honest. This house is falling. We'll never survive I get that he is winter. telling the truth right now. But hey, you know. Most of us uh, won't even live to see together it. Together we shall survive. And then admit your crime. Uh, let's see. We are in this together. You say that, but it won't be you who's starving come winter. Golly, <coughs> stop hitting the man. Lord. He's just telling this side of the story. Lord Ethan, you must decide the punishment. Lord Gregor always took a thief's fingers. Three of them. Now may not be the time for harsh punishment. The men are on edge as it men is. Men need to know they cannot do whatever the fuck they please. Their lord will not permit it. You can send him to the wall. Yeah, I want to send everybody to the wall. This should answer for everything. Send him to the wall. I will decide. Send him to the wall. Take his fingers. He's a thief. If you punish me, you'll be punishing an innocent man. It will be an injustice, my lord. Please. Take three fingers. Lord, send him to the wall. My family Show him mercy. On me. I don't want to cut his fingers, guys. I think cutting his fingers is, is the wrong decision to make. I don't know if I need to show him mercy in front of all these folks, because they won't... I'm going to send him to the wall. I sentence you to the wall, where you will join the Night's Watch. No! Please, my lord! My family, without me, they'll die! Hell, that's what they do on the show most of the time, when they don't know what to do with somebody, they send them to the wall. So, hey, I'm the director. Coop director Cooper. I'm go to the wall. Be gone with you. That was certainly unpleasant, but a lord must meet our punishment when it's due. Not just yourself, I was right. of course. It didn't bother me. It was my duty. Any lord. It's a lord's duty, so I did it. You heard what the thief said. I expect this sort of thing will happen again. But a sentinel can help you in the face of disloyalty. You need someone you can trust by your side. Someone you can I choose you. No matter the circumstances. <laughs> I trust spot, I mean, Possessing uh, wisdom and experience. Who do you think I should yeah. choose? There are two capable men for the role. They both want the job, but neither thinks very highly of the other. How do I decide between them? Talk to them. Solicit the opinion of people close to you. Here. The Bracer of the Sentinel. The Badge of Office. Tonight is your first small council meeting. It would be wise to bestow this bracer upon your chosen sentinel then, to show that you are decisive and in control of this house. Your sentinel will wear Thank this you. for all to I'll see. I'll make the right choice. I'll make the right choice as sentinel. Come speak with me when you're ready to convene the small council, my lord. Okay, see, I thought he wanted me to choose him. So, was he talking about... Uh, I kill anybody man right there or uh, I believe is his uncle not his uncle but uh, uh, the guy hit at first uh, girl all right so we, so we got young young Ethan about to do us some exploring Let's look over here guys I didn't want to come I was gonna go to the Our provisions are rather low my lord I made the count again, Alone, just to be sure. Lasts. How bad is it? How long could we hold the house? We couldn't withstand a siege, my lord. If the Boltons or the White Hills cut us off and wait us out, we'd only last a fortnight. Fortnight? There what the hell is a fortnight? steps we can take. In the past, we've demanded food from the small folk to replenish our stores. We can do it again, if you'd like. 
We've done it before in desperate times. That's, if that's necessary. The last long winter, something. my family had to give all our pigs to the house. No, there must be something else we can do. Well, I hope we find it soon. We won't have much room to maneuver if we don't have the option of holding fast. I can speak to the huntsmen and trappers. Perhaps they can do more. My lord. Alright. Even though I wasn't coming over here to talk to you yet, Duncan, I was... Oh, I can't even go any further. Look, look at the pig. That cut him from his fruit day to his two day. Alright. Want to something around here that we could uh, inspect? That's the tower. We don't want to go up there yet. Let's look at some more stuff down here. Oh, we got a shield. Let's check this out. I like the symbol. I like, you know, the sword in the tree. That is that is a very very nice uh, symbol, especially for this game. Uh, I guess yeah. This is the gate to get out. Like he a maid, like he ain't never seen a gate before. Say I talked to any one of these fine gentlemen. No. And they ain't around here. Do it like you made it. What do you say? Hold on. They must be talking over here. Okay, I gotta talk to his mean self. Well he ain't mean, but he just just old battle tested motherfucker. Come on, come on, what did I say? Swords up, slash right, parry, again! Sword up, swing left, parry. Wrong. I didn't know so dogs could hold swords. A word. Of course, my lord. I have many decisions to make, and I wanted your advice. All right, I need sentinel. Our defenses. What's the state of our defenses? Are these men ready for what's coming? This long, ready? No, but they will. We post anyone who can hold a spear along the parapet, up where they won't get much scrutiny, and put our meanest, nastiest looking brutes front and centre. That'll show Ramsay we're a force in our own right. You've got to project power, especially when you're weakened. Thank you, Sir Royland. I'll let you get back to training these men. Thank you, my lord. And uh, I'll be sure to watch out for more deserters. After today, I suspect there'll be more to come. Alright, did, did I need to ask him about the sentinel? Let me ask him. I'm, I'm asking him about that too. Yes, my lord. Let me see. I need to name a sentinel. Ah, you do. And it's good you came to me. I know this house, and everyone here knows me. They know I can hold the reins, or wield the sword in equal measure. I'm the man you need. And might I remind you, it was Duncan Tuttle who sent Garrett to the wall. He undermined your authority and made you look weak to the White Hills. I would never do that to you. And if you pardon the me, words wise, I haven't made up my mind. Your father would be proud. I haven't made my decision yet, but I appreciate your opinion. I'm just checking prices. So, when will you declare your decision, my lord? Tonight, at the small council meeting. Very good. I trust your judgment, my lord. I don't know. I mean, I mean, Roland. He, he he doesn't seem that bad. Uh, like I said, he just. Now, when I say parry, get that sword out. He's just, he's just real uh, rough around the edges. Talk to this guy, Ethan. Or should I say, Lord Ethan? Who's this guy? Hello, Uncle Malcolm. Oh, I saw what you did today. It's not an easy thing to do, showing mercy to a man who admits his guilt. But if you'll excuse me, my lord, I should finish packing before nightfall. I hope to be where, up tomorrow. Where are you going? But where are you going? Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Asher. Asher? She has asked me to return with him, to help the house. She said nothing of this to me. Because she fears you will not agree. I told her my place is here, that I'll be of no help to you in Essos. But she insisted. I will halt, of course. Until you've spoken with her about this. Just try to be kind to her. She's been living a nightmare made real. But you I know that just as well. I'll be gentle. <laughs> uh, I know what to say. She's my mother. I know how to speak to her. I'm sure you do. 
But my mother's fears are not the only ones I face. My people are scared as well. I'm told I must choose a sentinel. If I may be so bold, Sir Roiland is the man for the job. He'd be a fine choice. I don't choice. think so. You're right and about Sir uh, Why are you so sure? Sir Roiland is the man you want. Why Sir Roiland? We are at war. You need a warrior by your side. That, that, that is a good Roiland point. Has the That's a good point. Men and will bring strength and discipline to this house. Duncan would offer sage advice, but now is not the time to negotiate. Not with the likes of Ramsay Snow. Thank you, Uncle. Ethan, I need to talk to you. Hold on, girl. Who you? Who are you pulling me off to so damn quick? Mother told me Mira has asked for Lady Marjorie's help. Did she? I knew we could rely on Mira. She always thinks of family above all else. Hopefully Lady Marjorie's influence will be enough. But right now I'm more concerned about you. I saw what you did to that man. I know you told me you'd have to change, but I suppose I hadn't believed you would. I can't afford any more mistakes. Everyone knows what happened with Lord Whitehill. Garrod being sent to the wall without my knowledge. I know. And that wasn't your fault. Well, I'm the Lord. It's my responsibility. The people want me to lead. They need me to, but... What? Who should be Sentinel? Please. Which father were here? Massa. Who should I name as my Sentinel? To get information from him. definitely be Duncan Tuttle. He's dependable and smart, and everyone trusts his judgment. Sir Roiland is unpredictable and likely to make matters worse. She is right about that. You've always given me good advice. Thank you. Damn, why can't I take both of them and merge them into one person? Maester? Yes, Lord Ethan. Are you prepared to name your sentinel? Yes, I am. Not yet. What's your perspective? What is it you're doing over here? Admiring the ironwood, my lord. I studied it at the Citadel. The wood may be black, but I see gold. An entire forest of gold. What do you mean? It is our greatest asset, my lord. Why not give some of our ironwood to House Bolton and have them leave us be? We could ransom ourselves. You can hardly put a price have? on your own life. That is or the some... lives of those you love. A sensible plan, Maester. It may come to that. I am glad to hear your mind is open to possibility. Uh, I think I am. I think I'm ready. Yes, Maester. I'm ready. Very well. I will convene the small council at once. 